Next celebrity up to try and beat the chasers, it's comedian and author Catherine Ryan. <laughs> She's stolen one of your outfits, eh? Huh? Extremely sparkly. Hello, welcome to the show. Nice to see you again. Nice to see you. Uh, you so you've been on our uh, regular celebrity show, haven't you? The Chase. The Chase. And how did you do on that? I had a great time. Who did I, you play? I played against you mostly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and I was really excited to see you again, Mr. Walsh, because you and I are the sexiest people in Hertfordshire. Did you know that? I didn't know that. It's in the local news. You're the sexiest man in all of Hertfordshire, and I'm the sexiest woman, so I needed to be close to you. It's kind of a chase within the chase. Is that true? Yeah. Don't you read our local newspaper? Can I just remind you both that I have recently moved to Watford? Mm. <laughs> ah. <laughs> well, listen, you've got a Netflix series, The Duchess, didn't you? That is really great. Thank you. Now, weren't you a Hooters waitress? Yes. And here you are. He wouldn't know what Hooters waitress was. Uh, uh... An owl sanctuary. <laughs> 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 uh, anyway, look, now you've written a book about your journey from being in charge of Hooters right the way through. Um, the audacity. The audacity, that's it. It just charts your life. I think that's fantastic. People want to know how you did it. And I could have gone into a, a hundred different bad paths. And then I just decided to, to be on Beat the Chasers instead <laughs> and be the nation's sweetheart. Cool. I like it. All right. Let's do this. You're going to need some money to take on the gang. What charity are you playing for? I'm playing for WISC. It's Women's Health and Information Support Centre that helps families throughout Greater Liverpool. OK, you're going to need some money to take on the Chasers. You ready? Yes. Let's play. <laughs> Good luck, Catherine. Thank you. Hertfordshire's sexiest woman. Here's your first question. What adjective describes the housewives of Jersey in the title of a reality TV series? Is it A, real, B, hot, C, desperate? OK, what do you reckon? A, real housewives of Jersey. OK, real housewives of Jersey, is that the right answer? <laughs> yeah, it is. Thousand pounds, you're taking on the chases anyway. OK, here we go. Here's the next question. What type of pastry is normally used to make a chocolate eclair? A, shoe. B, short crust. C, puff. <laughs> what do you reckon? I don't eat pastry. I think it's C, puff pastry. You think it's C, puff pastry? Is that the right answer? <laughs> it is the wrong it's answer. shoe pastry. I hate pastry. You do? isn't a food, and a lot of people in my family are celiac because they're Celtic, and I just didn't grow up with it. So I see pies now, and the filling's delicious, but I don't know why you put it in that stuff. If you didn't put it inside the stuff, it'd fall through your fingers and everywhere. Yeah. That's not much good, is it? All right, no. the correct answer is, for chocolate eclairs, it's shoe menace. First of all, you're just clearly wrong about pastry, but eclair comes from the French word for lightning. Oh! Because you eat them so quickly, because they're so delicious. <laughs> OK, Catherine, here we go. You've got okay. £1,000. You're taking on the chasers nonetheless. Are you ready? I'm ready. Time to face the chasers. <laughs> here we go, Catherine, quick for a head-to-head -head against the gang. All right, we put 60 seconds on your clock and we'll put 60 seconds on the chaser's clock. But if you want to play for the £1,000 you've got in the cash builder, you automatically take on two chasers, and those two chasers are... It's the Vixen and the Menace. Dara. Well, Catherine, you being one of Hertfordshire's sexiest, I buy that, but Brad? <laughs> Shocking. OK, here we go. Vixen, what's the offer of time, please? Time advantage? I'll always be minded to be generous to my cousin. We want 38 seconds on our clock. OK, 22 second time advantage, that's all right. If you want to take on three chasers, third chaser, please. It is the beast. Go ahead. If you've got the audacity to take us on, we want 40 seconds on our clock and you'll be playing for £10,000. All right, so 20 second time advantage. Fourth chaser, who's that, please? Governess. Catherine, we have so much in common. We're both smart, Funny, we've both worked in Hooters, <laughs> but you just dissed pastry, so you're dead to me. <laughs> we want 42 seconds on our clock, and you'll be playing for £25,000. 
Right, OK, so... 18 second time advantage, 25k. If you want to take on a full house destroyer... We want 45 seconds on our clock, and you'll be playing for 50. £50,000. So this is the tricky bit. What are you thinking? I don't want to sell myself too short, Mr Walsh. No. I think I can beat three chasers. You do? OK. 20-second time advantage. Playing for ten grand against three chasers. Catherine, I wish you luck. It's time to see if you can beat those chasers. <laughs> right, here we go. Catherine, you know how it works. If they run out of time before you, your charity gets ten grand. I wish you luck. Here we go. Are you ready? I'm ready. Your clock starts counting down now. What November event marks the gunpowder plot? Remembrance Day. Bonfire night. Marsh fever is another name for what tropical disease? Pass. Malaria. What type of food product are dolly mixtures? Biscuits. Sweets. What is a female walrus called? Uh, pass. Cow. Who presents the TV quiz show Winning Combination? Pass. Homage Lily. Cherry is a variety of what salad ingredient? Pass. Tomato. Jennifer Lopez was born in what New York borough? The Bronx. Correct. Chasers, in what century did Alfred Nobel patent dynamite? Mark. 19th. Correct. Catherine, which graffiti artist created the character Gangster Rat? Banksy. Correct. Chasers, which former Olympic medalist founded the Great North Run? Mark. Brendan Foster. Correct. Catherine, how is Agent Kevin Brown known in the Men in Black films? Pass. Agent K. James Herriot wrote about his life in what profession? Pass. Veterinary surgeon. What does a mnemonic help you do? Float. Remember. And another thing is a 2017 tour by which London comedian? Michael McIntyre. Mickey Flanagan. What cocktail is known as a Turbo Jäger in German? Oh, no! Uh... That was a Jäger bomb. Ouch. Caught with 32 seconds left on their clock. OK. Tricky, nonetheless. Hard work, isn't it, right? Yeah, I didn't... Well, you either know the answers or you don't. I it, didn't. That's exactly right. Dixon? Yeah, I think you were pretty unlucky with the start there. You were just distracted by Brad's sexiness. And honestly, the people of Hertfordshire can't be wrong, can they? No. <laughs> well, listen, that's the way it goes. You've been beaten by the chasers, but you know what? You can't go home empty-handed. It's a charity show. Yeah. So we'll give you a £1,000 for your charity. Catherine Ryan, Thank everyone. You, there, Catherine. <laughs> Yes, she did give it a go. Yeah.